firewall again today we are going to see how we can utilize checkpoint firewall lab which is freely available for you guys to do the whatever the lab activity you are, want to perform in okay so let's start with how you can you know utilize checkpoint firewalls such facilities so everybody knows that there is some community called checkmate when you log into the checkmate uh, on the home page itself you are able to see this uh, arrangement but if you don't want to go there directly jump to the lab uh, just try to copy this URL in your browser and from there you will be redirected to this page the one which you are seeing i'll be putting this url on a description box you can copy paste from there and from uh, there you can utilize this uh, feature so if you come here if you see there are lab list and whatever the, your requirement accordingly you can utilize this lab today i'll be talking about the lab for the beginners so checkpoint checkmate they have given us a checkpoint for beginners network security virtual labs so you need to utilize this feature how you just have to come to this page and from here you have to go to the lab i'm just clicking this go to the lab and once you click that part you will be able to see different things one how you can prepare your lab the free video itself from the checkpoint checkmate how you can install the management server how you can install the security gateways gaia web ui and cli things and a lot of stuff is freely available for you guys to learn okay so you before people going to the lab just you know go through all these videos it will be helpful for sure now let's see there is something here called launch lab once you click here uh, you'll be redirected to the uh, lab details and it's saying welcome to the future of the cyber security and now status is preparing that means your lab is getting prepared meanwhile we will see what is this guy cp4b blueprint material if you click here you will be redirecting to the pre-available details or pre-available study material from the checkpoint itself if you see for the beginners everything is available the architect part preparing the lab installing the security management server installing security gateway guy web and cli part six working with smart console to the end see lot of stuffs available so you can utilize this stuff you know for preparing your lab plus you know having details if you click here you will redirect here and here itself they have given you a lot of description details you just have to read these details and accordingly understand and prepare your own lab I'm sure most of us we don't know this facilities which is predefined available from the checkpoint ideally vendors they don't give us a sort of facility but checkpoint is giving you this facility so guys please utilize it okay now let me go back to the lab here yeah. so now it's saying preparing let's okay refresh so now just i have refreshed and you will see a lot of you know jump server kvm lab 01 those details available here and please note guys this environment is available for you for four hours 
I think four hours is more than enough or sufficient to understand and you know prepare your lab. This arrangement is because only you know a lot of people are accessing this thing, so everyone should get you know a good amount of time and uh, good bandwidth. That's why they have arranged these things. So this is your credential. Login name is admin. Password is whatever is shown here. Now you can directly do the RDP to this guy, thirty-five two zero two one zero five one two two or you just do the download from here it will download the jump server rdp file and you just have to click that all right uh, before that let me copy this guy so i will directly put the username and the password and we'll go to the lab itself all right remember my credential if in in case i lost my connection now it's configuring the remote session and you are able to see uh, I am logged into the checkpoint world itself to the right lab thing. Now let me see if I can minimize this guy so you can able to see each and every stuff clearly. Bear with me okay right i think this is what i can show you so here if you see cv cp 4b1 this gives you the lab topology like what checkpoint has designed for you and this is what you have to follow to prepare this lab so if you see your management server it has an IP address 192.168.1.100 right your user PC is 192.168.1.10 and router and everything is here okay this is it for this video next video will be preparing the lab and creating actual environment thanks for watching this video if you like my video please subscribe my channel and bell icon so, latestly uploaded video will come to you as soon as I upload them.